So this is Consensus, consensus.app. And basically this is a search tool backed by AI that is seeking to differentiate itself from Google, right? So we know that when we go to Google, um, we can get a whole host of answers. Um, and what Consensus is saying is, listen, um, do you wanna rely on the major search engines which are ad supported search? Uh, or do you wanna use our search engine which is results based on evidence from peer reviewed studies? So it invites us to really sort of think about the question and the evidence we want and how it answers that so we can get informed, make a decision, so on and so forth. So uh, <clears throat> again, this is a typical first time walking through. I have no idea what I'm going to get into here. Um, I'm going to log in and uh, let's see, I'll just, uh... so I just used my Google credentials to log in. I've got a uh, account, this is in beta, as you can see, not quite sure um, what eventual pricing is. You could see here, it's got some interesting questions here. I'm going to try to do one. Um, uh, let's see, let's just ask it. Um, so to keep it relevant to legal, I just basically put in what are the physical and mental health trends at an S within legal profession and are lawyers less healthy than other other professions. So I have no idea what we're going to find here. This will be interesting. Uh, it's thinking, probably going through its vast array of peer reviewed research papers. I'm going to, oh, right when I was going to pause, here we go. Um, thanks for trying. This is not your average search engine. Okay. Each tile contains a finding that our AI has extracted. Okay. It's, it's giving me a little tour. If I want to share this result, I click the share button. Um, share the page and not sure what to search for, for tips. Okay. That's a pretty good, as a result, parent talk does not mean it's true. Interpreting research is complicated. Clicking the tile to dig into the details paper it comes from. Okay. So it's saying basically, even though it's displaying answers or replies to the question or prompt, it's not saying whether or not it's, it's displaying here is actually true, still inviting us to dig in, read the paper, and draw our own conclusions. Okay, that's fair. Uh, it'd be nice if we got some sort of uh, gauge or other barometer that suggests the level of accuracy, like our, our or confidence score, like this statement, we have a confidence score of you know 80% or 20%. It would help us understand how much we need to take this on faith and or dig in. Um, let me just uh, play around here and, and see what else I can come up with. Okay, so I spent some time sort of clicking through. Let me just show you. I'm going to click on this first one. Um, this takes us to the finding here that it's drawn out and to the actual paper. Uh, it tells us where it's from, how many citations and other papers are made to this, and the abstract as well. Uh, I've just clicked on the full paper. And now this takes us to the scholarly research site. Some of these are paywalled. Some of these are freely available. But this is a really interesting way to find research um, much more quickly than uh, some of your other sort of scholarly search engines out there. It's also a way to find evidence. So there's some evidence back um, research to your pursuit and prompt. I'm going to try another quick one here. Okay, I put in uh, to do bank bailouts have long term detrimental impacts to the US economy with the collapse of Silicon Valley Bank uh, late last week and dominating headlines. I figured let's let's look into this. So um, these are the re research results. Again, um, doesn't explicitly answer the question. It's just gathering the research and giving me the statement here uh, that really sort of helps me understand what the position of the paper is and what its findings are. And, you know, we can copy this, we can send it to Twitter, um, and then we can basically go directly to the abstract and the full text. So listen, I think consensus is really, for anyone out there who is um, looking for secondary uh, sources or resources for a paper, a memo, or presentation you're putting together. Uh, consensus seems like a really easy way to find that evidence research and find those resources. So uh, a really interesting app or, or software, I'm going to be using it, uh, consensus.app.